Hi students, welcome to Samachi Study YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to do solve problem number 1 from standard 10 science unit 2 optics. Problem in Anpatharlam. Light rays travel from vacuum to a glass whose refractive index is 1.5. So, what do you say? Light rays from vacuum to the glass travel ahadhu. ok this is a refractive index glass is refractive index ok next if the angle of incidence is 30 degree calculate the angle of refraction inside the glass we know that two different transparent materials la light ray pass ahadhu and refraction nadakum. ok so now in the figure note pannunga. this first medium vacuum second one glass so, this is the light ray pass. This the interface. The the glass pass the and the refraction. So, this is the normal perpendicular line. This is the angle of incidence. Okay? This is the angle of refraction. Now, glass is the refractive index value. That is mu2. Second media is mu2. Okay? So, that is 1.5. But, Vacuum is refractive index and well known. This is 1. That is value 1. That is the problem. You can see the value. So, vacuum mu 1 and mark refractive index. Okay? So, mu 1 equal to 1, mu 2 equal to 1.5. Then, I is the angle of incidence 30 degree. Now, calculate the arc. This R calculate the R the unknown. So, now we have the textbook. What is the formula? What is the relate to this? What is the relationship to this? Refractive index is Snell's law. In the law is the sin i divided by sin r equal to mu2 by mu1. Students, we have given values. Given values mu1 theriyo, mu2 theriyo, i value. What is the value of r? Matana. Substitute panir lama. So, sin i by sin r na, sin 30 divided by sin r equal to mu2. That is the glass level refractive index 1.5 divided by refractive index at vacuum. So, 1. So, now cross multiply. Simple. So, cross multiply. Here is sin 30. Tha, 1 into sin 30. That is the opposite side. Line 1.5 multiplied by sin r. Now, sin 30 is value. Sin 30 degree equal to 1 by 2. So, that is substitute. Sin 30, 1 by 2. This is trigonometry. Okay? 1 by 2 equal to 1.5 multiplied by sin r. Okay? So, now, in this 1.5, in this 2 multiply. Okay? So, how do multiply? 1 divided by 3 equal to sin r. Now, 1 divided by 3 value calculate is very simple. 1 divided by 3 is 0.333 continuous. Okay? This answer is correct. So, sin r equal to 0.333. So, now R is the sin inverse of this value. So, R equal to sin inverse of 0.333. This is the sign table. This is the value. Sin inverse of this equal to 19.45 degree. So, this is the angle of refraction. Okay? So, very simple problem. Just Snell's law apply. Panni. If you substitute values, you will the angle of refraction. Ok students, hope you understand this problem. If you like this video, please subscribe and share it to your friends. Thank you so much for watching.